Welcome back everybody. This is Red Halo here. We're playing more One Piece Treasure Cruise and we're going to be going over Arena Hawkins, the 12 star difficulty in this video today with a treasure map Sanji team. Uh, I like treasure map Sanji. I think he's very versatile and just overall has a very good kit. And so I like using him. And so I just thought I'd make a video of that today. Uh, going into this, the only things that you need to know about for support wise is having a Luffy character. It doesn't have to be Snake Man. Be any Luffy character on the Ace Sabo. You can get the three turns of the orb boost. That's going to be very important. Also, starting with the Psy Frankie is going to be important as he gets rid of attack down uh, by 10 turns with his Psy Captain ability. Anyways, Battle 1 and 2, don't really need to worry about those. It's just mobs, and you can stall a little bit like I did, but you don't absolutely have to. Uh, one thing that you definitely need to do is make sure that you are going into Stage 3 with Sabo up, as well as having a Quick Orb on that Sabo. So I switch here to go to the Ace so that I can make use of the Sanji Captain effect, where he automatically does his special when you enter the fight and gives you a higher chance of getting matching orbs and so it's very easy to get a quick orb on that ace right off the bat uh, but making sure that you go into stage three with the sabo with a quick orb is important as well as you just need to hit with the characters that are adjacent to a sabo so you can have a full board going into stage three when you get to stage three it's going to be important that you hit all your perfects because the attack down is going to be getting rid of which you'll be given five turns of very easy to get rid of because frankie just gets rid of it for you you'll also be given 98 turns of normal attacks only uh so no special that deal damage are you going to be doing anything or health cuts uh hit all your perfects if you don't don't really worry about it if you have your hunger high enough with fun clay you only need to get rid of two turns of that and the recovery down is getting gotten rid of with Ivankov um, and Frankie. And if you have a few turns left over, it's not that big of a deal. Ivankov by himself gets rid of seven turns. So going into stage four, you're going to be given Hawkins here with 8 million HP. He's going to have five turns percent damage reduction, five turns of resilience. He's going to give you two turns of attack down chain below two times, seven turn crew bind on the top row, and five turn special bind as well as giving you fully block sword orbs uh you get rid of this all with just a sabo and a vonkov if vonkov's going to get rid of the percent damage reduction as well as your um resilience and the ace and sabo as long as you're on the quick variation that's important for the final stage gets rid of basically everything else and you'll have more than enough damage going into the next fight here uh, just make sure that you are going into the next fight with the Psy Frankie as your captain. Going into the final fight, we're going to also be fighting Hawkins again. He has 35 million HP this time, and he will change to a strength type right away. You're going to get 98 turns of enemy immunity, so there's no real anything you can do to him there. Uh, 8 turns of despair, 8 turns increased damage taken and one turn of crew special reverse. He's also going to reduce your HP by 80% and give you empty and bomb slots. Uh, we're going to get rid of most of this with the Jozu here, which is going to get rid of the despair as well as give us a damage reduction of 80%, which is going to really, really help because once you kill Hawkins, he's going to recover with 14 million HP as well as deal 30,000 damage to you. So you're not going to have a lot of HP going into this stage with this team. And so the damage reduction is very important um, with the 80% definitely giving you more than enough uh, to tank that hit. We're also going to be using Von Clay here as he's going to give us a fully board of recovery slots, which will be kind of matching with his sailor ability, as well as giving us a chance to change him to a quick typing, as well as a base attack boost for an entire team of 1500. Very, very good. Uh, we're also going to be using the Sanji special here, as well as the super type to give us a attack boost, since we already have a orb boost from the previous stage with Ace and Sabo. So we'll be getting a two times attack boost, which you can turn to a 2.3 times with his super type. You don't want to be using the Frankie special here because we're going to be needing it for when the revive happens because you're going to be giving a full board of poison slots. 
which Frankie actually gets rid of with his special ability. So all you have to do on the final stage once he revives is switch, which you'll be giving a color finny. And you can then use the special and give you a full board of matching orbs as well as a orb boost with his special. Um, and you'll be given, you know, the straight up attack boost that you got from the Sanji special, which you get four turns of it. So you'll definitely have that. Uh, and that's boosted as well with the super type. So you have a 2.3 times attack boost and a 2.5 times orb boost with the Frankie. So that's more than enough to get rid of everything and go ahead and uh, kill Hawkins at the very end here. One thing that you do need to know is that when you revive, or when Hawkins revives, you're going to be given everything that turn 1 would give you as well, which is uh, his attack up. You're going to be given 4 limit tap, so you can only attack with 4 units here. Make sure you end with uh, Bond Clay and Dabonese, and and turns of attack down which you can get rid of with frankie very easy already good to go and uh that's gonna be it for this video today just one team here uh slowly getting into a hope to do more videos like this in the future and if you enjoyed this video go ahead and hit that like button for me it helped me out a great deal as well as subscribe to get notified when i put out more videos that are one piece for the related and check out the description it's going to have a link to my twitter as well as my Twitch page, uh, where we are live a lot playing One Piece Shredder Cruise, as well as a lot of other stuff. Um, anyway, I hope this team helps out some of you. Um, it's just kind of a fun team. It's nothing groundbreaking or anything, but uh, it does get the job done. Anyways, this is Rahel, guys. See you later.